The masterpiece because they have not dropped. They continue. It's not like they have never failed. They failed, but still they came out of that failure and learned from their failures. Same is applicable in each area of the life. I would say hackathon or anything else. So what I what I'm saying that all six teams which are here are the really winners. Even we can quantify saying this is one, this is two, this is three in, in ranking, but all six are winners because they are here. They are in the battle. You can come and say, I have done, I have, I have done something where I was supposed to be, I was there. So that's the first thing I would say. All of you are better, first thing. Second, uh, one, one thing which I would like to highlight about the hackathons. It's about coming out of your cell, doing something extraordinary in two and a half days, three days, what you got. You are not regularly working. That, okay, two days I will work for six or eight hours, take a full night of sleep and be comfortable and then work, start working again. You are pushing yourself. And when you are really pushing yourself, you have that thought running in the mind. Try to do things that you have never done. You will be able to produce extraordinary results only when you have this thought in the mind in Akathon that anything which I was afraid of, you are pushing your limits. And knowingly or unknowingly, you are going next step. My suggestion will be for all of you that whenever you are participating in a hackathon, try to do things that you have never done it, which are beyond your limits. That's the only uh, suggestion I have. And once again, uh, when when we judged and then discussed, we were contemplating about few of the teams. Are they equal with somebody some better? Then we have to go on back to the drawing board and say, okay, these are the right areas. Given those criteria, there have been ties between teams. I'm not sure that I'm able to put the right uh, uh, numbers on that. Okay, if somebody is 3.5 and another is 3.4 or 3.6, you cannot differentiate. Okay, so whatever we have done is from our experience, we have seen those things and given the results. Uh, Take it in a way that if I am here, I am a winner and if I am not making in a top 3, still I work somewhere there because there, I would say a lot of work you guys have done which was really great and we as a just may not have done the proper justification on those. Uh, having said those words, I will give my cue. Thank you. And before you leave, Hemant, I know if you can just sum up a small token of our appreciation. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for your time. Shivani. Hey guys, uh, so thank you for coming here and pitching your projects. I'm rightly said by Hemant, who's, who's an expert in this space. So, yeah, I mean, while we evaluate your projects, we really appreciate the behind the scenes because it takes a lot to, you know, come here and pitch your projects to us. So, yeah, really appreciate that. And just one thing that you have to remember is you don't need, like, a new idea to be in the Web3 space or a unique idea. You just need, maybe, it can be a similar idea, but with a unique factor to it. And, you know, the building has to be along with the execution and planning. So I think the BD part really makes a difference. So yeah, focus on that and I think uh, you're good to go. And please stick to your ideas and please work on it. And uh, yeah, you really inspire us. Thank you. Awesome. And Yogesh, can we have Yogesh, one of the organizers?